Well, let's see what fascinating pubescent treasures Chris has got hidden away. Ooh, Hustler magazine. I finally get to see what a vagina looks... Ah, ah, oh, God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! <laughs> you can't hurt anyone anymore. All right, but just one last piece of advice. Remember, listen to her body and respond the way you'd want her to respond to you. Uh, okay, thanks. That's very helpful. You'll be a wonderful lover, Brian. What are you doing? Oh, sorry, you, you just had a little, uh, something. Quick, get the parachutes! There are no parachutes. All I could find was this. A raft? We're not sinking! We're crashing! Lois! I know how to get her attention. Lois, I'm about to drink my first soda. Better come stop me. Mmm, that must be the sugar. Oh, God, that's good. Rupert, suddenly I want to run. Chase me. Oh, now I'm sad. This could save us a lot of money. Yeah, everyone except Brian, because he bought a Prius. What a dumbass. <laughs> What, what, what I miss? Are we laughing at Brian? Ah, uh, Brian, you suck. Good job, Brian. Don't worry, I'll help you through this. So, you want to get something to eat? Can we go someplace where the menus have pictures of the food? Oh, let's go someplace where the menus have pictures of the food! <sighs> oh, I know you're tired, Stewie, but you can sleep all you want in the car. Ugh, 6 a.m. I shouldn't have stayed up all night listening to Persian radio. Hey, that was Roxette with You've Got the Look. It's 21 o'clock and still 27 centigrade out there. Hook that's hot. So, if you're cruising along the left side of the road at 120 kilometers per hour in the Shchevi Desert, turn up the decibels, because it's Shelev Mami with Zechech Malech on 103.2, the Hach. Pardon me, sir. I'd like to join. What are your qualifications? I have a British accent. I'm possibly homosexual. I never brush my teeth, and my wife is ghastly. Bombs away. There's no sign of them anywhere. Meg? Chris? Brian? They're gone. I'm all alone. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> I'm going to take Brian's novel and replace every use of the word and with the word fart. The young soldier, Fart his brother, looked at each other. Fart both knew that with love, Fart truth, Fart courage, they would both emerge st farting on their feet. Uh, that one didn't work. Oh, you know, this is why... You, Brian, you remember the last couple of weeks I kept saying, can I have a couple of minutes of your time to talk to you about something? This is what it was about. This evening is ruined. Look, I... Wait, what? This evening is ruined. The whole evening is ruined. Why are you saying it like that? Saying what? I'm just pointing out the party's ruined. You know what? I'm not going to get sucked into this. Okay, just so I'm sure, really? Are, are you just trying to piss me off, or is that really how you say that? What are you talking about? I'm talking about this ruined evening. That's not how you say ruined. What? Ruined? What do you call the remains of ancient Greek structures? Ruins. And how would you describe this evening? Well, ruined, of course. This evening is ruined. Say ruined. 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 Dumbass. Oh, Brian, don't be cruel. What are you talking about? You ripped a whole chunk of wall out of the house. What is this? There's something wrong with the house. I don't like change. Do we? You in there? You think he's here? <laughs> oh, God, it's Cleveland and Bob Hope. Oh, well, the damage is done. Better get him out of here. Perhaps I'll shackle them in the basement with a 24-hour broadcast of the DirecTV help channel. So, Carolyn, guess you should have hit that when you had the chance, huh, Brian? What? You're the one who told me to wait! Oh, you're crazy, bitch. I didn't say that, bitch. And all the juice is being collected underneath? Yes, and whoever collects the most is gonna win a free weekend here at the Chateau with international foods and wine tasting. Stop! Uh -huh. Oh! 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 I can't breathe! I can't breathe! Ow, 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 Uh-oh. <clears throat> oh, no. Oh, no. Hey, hey, hey! Help! Help! Hey! 
Hey, Brian! Brian! What the hell? Call the fire brigade! Get a ladder! Get me down! What are you doing up there? Counting the stars in Orion's penis! What do you think I'm doing up here? I'm stuck! How'd you get on the roof? What am I doing, an interview? Shut up and get a ladder or something! Actually, yeah, maybe we are doing an interview. So, Stewie, tell us about that new project you have coming up. What are you talking about? Get me down, you douche! No, first you tell me about that new project. Oh, you're so dead! Is that the title of your new film? Uh, um, I've been working on a new movie, and it's really great. Toss me a rope! No, that's not good enough. I want details. Oh, I'm gonna slit your throat in your sleep! Um, well, uh, when you're working with Jack Black, uh, you just gotta keep up, you know? I mean, he's doing his thing, and you gotta, you gotta match his energy level without looking like you're trying to one-up him, because, you know, that's a game you're just not gonna win. What was it like having the privilege of performing the words of Oscar winner Diablo Cody? She's an overpriced call girl who got lucky once! Ooh, that doesn't sound like an interview answer. Say something nice about Diablo Cody. I envy the tattoo artist who had that huge canvas of arm fat to work with. <laughs> oh, wonderful, wonderful. Hey, listen, can you hang with us through the break? What? We'll be right back with Stewie's co-star, Robin Williams. No, no, I hate Robin Williams. Where are you going? No. God, you're more worthless than Colin Farrell. So, uh, you got the wool cap on, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I guess, you know, uh, whatever, it's uh, 96 degrees out. Yeah, better, better put on the old wool cap. Yeah. Got a lot uh, going on under there, yeah? Under, under the wool cap? Thinking about your sideburns? Yeah, no, 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 you're not a complete jackass, yeah. Oh, hey, nice T-shirt. Fresh. And, it, and it's spelled with a P-H. Oh, that's fun, because it's usually spelled with an F. Yeah. Oh, and you got a little tear in your pants there. Oh, that's on purpose, though, isn't it? Uh, uh, you're a bad boy. You're a bad boy. Society wants your pants to be intact, but you're just not going to listen, are you? My God, this is ridiculous. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to kill you. Farewell, Brian. I'm off to sea. An hour from now, I'll be surrounded by semen. Sperm whales and semen. Ooh, a swallow. Oh, oh, oh. Good job, Brian. Oh, oh. Hi there. Not interested. Okay. You sound like an unbelievable douche. Then Brian comes in and I change up the tempo. Brian comes in and he changes the song. Looking at me like he thinks I'm a douchebag. But he's gonna learn pretty fast that he's wrong. Hey, Brian, why are you bringing me down, man? Why are you bringing me down? Don't bring me down! Music and lyrics by Stewie Griffin. And we especially don't like the way you hump that chair in the den. Well, Rupert seems to like my humping. What did you say? Rupert. Humped him for two hours yesterday. He just laid there and took it. Did he? Yeah. And now every time you're sleeping with him, he's going to be thinking of me. Hey, Juice. Uh, is it all right if I call you Juice? Great. Uh, listen, I was wondering if you could give me a little advice on how to murder a woman and get away with it. Oh, cool. Look at that. Hey, Chris, go long. Ah! Ah! Touchdown! Good grief. Chuck Connors? He was a basketball player and he was in Roots. Yeah, he wasn't in the towering inferno, you dumb beaver. Brian, look, I purchased authentic blueprints to build a Star Trek transporter. Well, that's great, Stewie. You should get William Shatner to sign them for you. No way. I'm getting Patrick Stewart to sign it. Picard has it all over Kirk. He's poised and measured and doesn't wear a cheap rug. Rather, he accepts even baldness with a quiet cool that says, I am in command. You are safe with me. I will cradle you in my arms through any crisis in any galaxy. Are you queer? Probably. Hey, everybody, look what came in the mail. We got invitations to Jillian's wedding. Jillian's wedding? She's getting married? Wow, that's great. Looks like she finally found someone after dating that last loser. She dated someone after me? No. See how I set up my own joke? You walked right into it, Brian. Walk right in. Sit right down. Stewie's gonna make you the fool. Must have pulled something playing hoops last week. I know you're not putting that rock up from here. You ain't got no J. Yo, man, that's trippy! Brother, please, you're the one who's tripping. Go on, cry home to your mama. She waiting for you. Now, don't make me put my size 13s up your narrow ass! I don't sweat you. Bring it on, bitch. Now, how are you gonna act? Sheesh. Bringing that trash in here? This is my house. Oh, great. I always end up sitting next to a damn baby. What? What did you just say? Stewie, stop fussing. Not now, Lois. 
Hey, big man, turn around. If you've got something to say, say it to my face. Oh, you can't hear me now. All right, that's it. I was going to watch the movie, but forget it. For the next five hours, you're my bitch. Where? Where? My ears are popping and there's no way to console me. I'm hungry and possibly teething. Maybe I'm wet. Who knows? I'm a baby. Where? Where? Are you watching porn in the kitchen? Come on, man. We eat it here. Anyway, I need you to drive me to Middleborough. Middleborough? That's like two hours from here. I'm not doing that. Come on, Brian. Tell you what. You drive me to Middleborough, and I'll teach you my secret to picking up chicks. Hey, you, me, baboom, huh? Uh, I haven't been this... Uh, since I... Uh, I... I don't... I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, but... Oh, there's track star Wilma Rudolph. Obviously, she had something to do with the gag, but I didn't hear the setup, so I don't really know the, the context. Hey, I wonder what Peter's up to. Maybe she'll let us do things that Lois won't let us do. Yeah! Hey, Mom, can I pull my pants down? If she doesn't answer, does that mean yes? That's what I've been going with. Yay! <laughs> I want to get in on that. <laughs> Mine's better! Mine's better! Mine's better! Ugh, look, there's Brody Jenner. God, what a douchebag. I can't believe that came out of Bruce Jenner's vagina. Bruce Jenner is a man. No, Brian. That's what the press would have you believe, but he's not. Bruce Jenner is a woman. An elegant, beautiful Dutch woman. Hey, you ever check Joe's Facebook? Ugh, oh, I know. Awful. Hidden Cheesecake Factory again. So amped. And then the symbol that means wink. Really? I mean, like, why, why the wink? I mean, is, is, there, is there something that we're supposed to be in on? Is, is, is he not going there? Is, is, he, is he not amped? And, and, and who cares if he is? You know? Dick. I'm off to the farmer's market. I've got to pick up some plutonium for a new return pad. In case I decide to make another universe later. Plutonium at the farmer's market? Yep, I'm only using organic plutonium now. Think globally, buy locally. Hey, slut, get me out of this. <laughs>